Hi friends, in this video we are solving a problem on vector integral calculus. Given problem is, find the work done is moving a particle in the force field F bar is equal to F1 i plus F2 j plus F3 k. F bar is we are denoting with F1 i plus F2 j plus F3 k. Yes or no? Along the straight line from a point to P to Q. 0, 0, 0, 2, 2, comma, 1, comma, 3. Now, what is we need to find? We need to find out the work done. Work done of a force field. So, they are given F bar. What is the work done formula we have? Integral over C, F bar dot dr bar. Here you observe, F bar are they given? Yes. What is dr bar we have? We have a dr bar is equal to dxi plus dyj plus dzk. And what you, what you can denote F bar as? F bar you can denote it with F1i plus F2j plus F3k. Then F bar dot dr bar will become F bar dot dr bar is F1 dx plus F2 dy plus F3 dz. So what about F1? 3x square. F2? 2xz minus y. F3? z. Substitute these all values in this integration. Right. Then integral over C F bar dot dr bar is equal to integral over C. F1 means 3x square into dx plus 2xz minus y into dy plus z into dz. Now you observe this is uh, nothing but a line integral form. Yes or no? Single integration is there. So line integral. Line integral we can separate each term. Generally if we separated this one you can integrate with respect to x. This one you can integrate with respect to z. But what about this? Can you integrate this one? No it is not possible in this case. Generally remember friends suppose if f of x comma y comma z or else pi of x comma y functions if they are given. If you want to do the line integral for this we have to convert all x, y, z variables as any one of the variable that may be x or y or z or else any other parametric form like t or else changing into single term. Here also pi of x comma y we have to change either x term or y term or else any other variable t. Then in this case only we can do the line integral. In the line integral we required only the integrand should be containing one term, one variable only. So, in this case, what we have to do? X values, Y values, Z values also we have to convert into one variable. How it is possible means see the curve, what they are given. Based on the curve only it is possible. What they are given is a straight line. Along the straight line from a point P002, 2, 1, 3. So, we know that uh, suppose O origin 0, 0, 0 or else P you can consider. It is not an issue. O, P I am considering this as 2, 1, 3. What about the straight line equation if they are given in three dimensional space straight, uh, straight line equation we have x2 minus x1 by x minus x1 sorry first x minus x1 by x2 minus x1 is equal to y minus y1 by y2 minus y1 is equal to z minus z1 by z2 minus z1. Now you substitute x value e as it is x y z values are as it is because you know only this is x1 y1 z1 and this is x2, y2, z2. Just you replace x1, y1, z1, x2, y2, z2 in this equation. But here you are changing x, y, z in terms of t. This is the straight line equation if they are given x1, y1, z1, x2, y2, z2 and x3, y3, z3. Then if you are substituted, then we will have x1 is 0. So x minus 0 is x. By x2 minus x1, 2 minus 0 is 2. This is equal to y minus 0 by 1 minus 1 minus 0. That is 1 z minus 0 by z minus 0 I am not writing I can write simply z z2 minus z1 z2 is 3 minus 0 that is 3 this is equivalent to t now you see a is equal to b is equal to c is equal to let it be 10 then a is equal to 10 no b is equal to 10 no c is equal to 10 similarly here x by 2 is equal to t can I write or not x by 2 is equal to t implies what you can say x is equal to 2t next y by 1 is nothing but y y is equal to t Next, z by 3 is equal to t. So, what you can write from this? z is equal to 3t. Now, you changed x, y, z values in terms of t. Similarly, what we have to change in the integral? dx, dy, dz. Also, the limits. Now, you change the dx, dy, dz, nothing but just you differentiate this one. Then, dx is equal to 2dt. Next, dy is equal to dt. And what about the last term? dz is equal to 3dt. 
So I got dx dy dz also in terms of what t. Next, what you require to find limits because we are integrating now the two this definite integral along the curve from O to P. So here x1 y1 z1 lower limits are zero. X lower limit is zero, y lower limit zero, z lower limit is zero. And x upper limit two, y upper limit two, one, z upper limit is three. But I want the upper limit of t. How can I find out? Nothing but from this formula we can find out. Put x is equal to zero. If you put x is equal to zero here, then t is equal to what? Zero. So t lower limit is in this case zero. Next, check it. But it should satisfy all cases because x y z all are equal. Na? That is the case. Put y zero, then z is t is zero. Yes, t is zero correct only. Next, put z is zero in this case. So 0 by 3 is nothing but 0, t 0, like right here, first condition that is the lower limit of t is clear for you. Next I want upper limit, upper limit means put x is equal to 2, 2 by 2 is 1, so t is equal to 1. Next y is equal to 1, you substitute upper limit, then you will have t is 1, right, correct only. Next z is equal to 3, 3 by 3 is t is equal to 1, yes, t is equal to 1 is the upper limit and t is equal to 0 is the lower limit we have. So t is uh, moving from 0 to 1. Now what we have to do means just we have to change all the values we have to substitute all the values in this equation in in this case we will have one moment please i will write in the next place now the curve limits we have t is equal to 0 to 1 next 3 into x square 3 into 2t whole square into dx what is the dx i have 2 dt you see dot product here plus 2 into x, x is 2t, bracket for this, z, what is the z, 3t, minus y, what is y, t, into dy, what is the dy, dt, plus z, what is the z I have, 3t, what is dz, 3dt, now you simplify this, in this uh, one you observe, all the terms are containing dt, so you can take a uh, dt outside, common and uh, it will come, it will become, t is from 0 to 1, 2t square is nothing but 4t square. 4t square, 4 3s are 12, 12 2s are 24. So 24 t square. Next, multiply inside. 2 2s are 4. This is plus. I am writing, you see. 2 2s are 4. 4 3s are 12. So 12 t square. Plus into minus. Minus t. Next, 3 3s are 9. 90. Bracket for this into dt. So again you simplify if there is any common term addition or subtraction we have to do. So 24 t square plus 12 t square is nothing but 36 t square. Minus t plus 90 is nothing but plus 8 t into dt. Now integration do it. What is the integral of t square? t cube by 3 plus 8 into. What is the t integration? t square by 2. Limits from 0 to 1. Now. 3 1s are 3, 3 12 are 36. So 12 t cube plus 2 1s are 2, 2 4s are 8, 4 t square. Now we need to substitute limit. Here I have substituting because here I have done simplification. Now upper limit minus lower limit is. Upper limit if you are substituted, 12 into 1 cube is 1 only. Plus 4 into 1 is nothing but 4. Upper limit over minus lower limit. In place of t we have to substitute 0. So 0 plus 0 again. So what I will get here? 16 minus 0 is nothing but 16. Therefore, the work done f bar dot dr bar is equal to 16. This is the final answer. Is it clear for everyone? Thank you for watching this video. Like this, we can do line integral problems. Remember, in the line integral or work done, we have to convert into any number of the variables, whatever they are given. x, y, z or x, y. Okay. Then we have to convert into single variable. Thank you for watching this video.